Hello and welcome back to Terraria. It's been a minute. I've been kind of busy trying to get myself better set up to fight the Wall of Flesh. And it's been a trial. So, I enjoy building. And I like making these big arenas. However, making the arena for the Wall of Flesh has been nothing short of infuriating. And the reason is simple. I have put campfires down, I have put bass statues down, I've been hanging lanterns and banners and everything else. But a couple of things have changed. So in doing a little bit of research, trying to figure out how better to equip myself to deal with the wall of flesh, one of the things that I saw is that bees are absolutely a way to go when fighting the wall of flesh. The only difference is, you don't use the bee gun. No, instead... You use the bee nades. And they work. So, in order to use bee nades, I can't have platforms down there. Because grenades, bombs, dynamite, everything else just goes right through them. So, I had to go down and replace all the platforms with actual brick. Now, that was the, that was the easy part. However, that led to another problem. Lava. See, down in the, the underworld, there are all these lava slimes. And when you kill them, they release lava. And when lava pours across the platforms, it wipes out everything. Campfires, statues, everything that's on the, the bridge. So I had to go through and redo parts of it with platforms to create drainage points it's been a hard and it's still not perfect but i've given up trying I i've decided that it's just never going to be perfect it, it it's it's just never going to be there's nothing i can do to fix it so i've done what i can i feel better set up now i think i'm ready to try this one more time in addition while I've been working down there, I also came across a Demon Scythe book. This is also one of the best weapons for fighting the Wall of Flesh, just because you can't miss it. I mean, there's a delay when you fire off Demon Scythes, but it, they're, it, it's the Wall of Flesh. Come on, you can't miss. So, I have extended my platform out. I have put campfires up, statues up, I have more potions here, I have new weapons, I have some voodoo dolls, it's time for us to go try this. So, we're going to go all the way to the end of this, this bridge, find a spot to throw this thing, and we're going to take off from there. Do I feel confident about this? Mm, not as much as I used to. However, it's what is. So. And with him running around, that's going to make things less pleasant. But let's go. Here we go. All right. Now, I still don't have a solution for all those lasers, except to just keep moving. But keeping moving is... Eh, get the minimap out of the way. It's, it's interesting. Alright, I'm just going to start throwing B-nades. All right, looks like we got the wall of flesh down to about half already. Okay, don't get hit by the lasers. No, no, no. 
Come on, leave me alone. He's down to like a quarter. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Wow, he shoots a lot of lasers now. Oh! That was close. That was super close. Oh, that, that was working. That was really working. He outran me. I didn't know he could get that fast. But that worked. That really worked. Okay, we're on to something here. I never claimed this was a no-death run, so I'm not going to feel bad about that. This is learning. This is master mode. I've done all this on easy before, or normal, or whatever the default is. I, I don't even remember. So it's not like it's the first time I beat the Wall of Flesh. It's the first time I beat him on master mode. So. I'm going to go back there with the same tactic. I'm not even going to do that much preparation. My armor was okay. I'm going to get healed up real quick. Please heal me. Thank you. I went through almost 100 bee nades, but they did a lot of damage. I just was not prepared for how fast he was. And a swiftness potion did not quite do it. Somewhere around here, though, I should have some cake. I just don't remember where it is. So, I'm going to have to go track down exactly where I had a piece of cake. Because I know I had one around somewhere. And then I will meet you down in the underworld for one more shot. Alright, I'll see you there. Alright, here we are. Back again. Get rid of that bee. Or not bee, bat. Get rid of the bat. Alright, ready to do this? One more time, not even waiting. Let's do it. Here we go. Just throwing bees. Yeah, 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 I know. You're firing lasers. I don't necessarily trust the bees if I can't see him. However, I also don't want to get too close just for when he speeds up. And he didn't get really fast until the end. But at that point, I'm going to have to go full speed. I've got the cake bonus this time, so I know I'm a lot faster. All right, we just passed the middle point. Just keep throwing them. I haven't done as much damage to him this time. All right, he should be coming quickly now. Oh, no, 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 don't, don't shoot me like that. No, 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 no. No, no. Leave me alone. Almost. He's done. He's done. Look at that. Wall of flesh down. I didn't even see him for most of it. Wall of flesh down. And there's the relic. Ancient spirits of light and dark have been released. Welcome to hard mode. Oh, hey, this, this side of it didn't actually form. <sighs> Crimtain brick. That, that's a thing. Okay, go away, demon. You know what? I'm not even waiting. I'm not even waiting. Um, grab anything that might have fallen. I don't think anything fell. And now my phone is talking to me. This, this is not a cooperative. Go away. Okay. Never mind. Forget the phone. That never happened. The important part, just beat Wall of Flesh. Boom! Right there. Wall of Flesh Relic. Whew! Man, when you do everything right, it's actually not that hard. 
When you do everything wrong, it's impossible. Go figure. I'm going to go ahead and put this right there. I didn't beat him here, but... What is, what is that? Possessed armor. What is that? Besides, really tough. And another one? And is that a... That's a... A white? Okay. I thought I might have a bit of a reprieve before all the weird stuff started showing up. I haven't even got to see what treasures I got. But okay, then. Wow, they are tough. All right, well, I put my relic outside. I'm going back inside. It's crazy out here. Hopefully they can't open doors or I'm going to have to redo something around here. Okay, so what do we got? A goat skull. A goat skull? All right, I'm curious. Um, where does this go? No, no, no. There. Uh-huh. Oh my god! Look at that thing! That thing is sinister looking! <gasps> and it bursts into flames when it gallops! That's cool. Not terribly useful when you have waypoints, but very cool. Let's run! That is super cool! Does it actually do damage? Uh, yeah, but it also uh, doesn't protect me. And right now I'm kind of hurting, so... I'm going to go ahead and drink that. Alright, so that's fun. Got a new mount. Don't have much of a use for mounts, but not not going to complain. Uh, brick. All right, let's see what's in here. Uh, pone hammer. Okay, I remember this. This hammer comes every time you beat the wall of flesh. Guaranteed. I also got a demon heart. Ooh. Oh! <gasps> More accessory slots. Cool. A warrior emblem. Now, see, that's a problem. Because I... That, that increases melee damage. There's four emblems. They are... Um, warrior for melee, ranged magic, and summoner. Obviously, I want the summoner one. But it's a random drop every time. And, yeah... And I also got the Breaker Blade. Which, even though I don't use Melee, this is basically the Buster Sword from Final Fantasy VII. And that makes it awesome. Okay, then. So, welcome to Hard Mode. Now, two things should have just shown up. And those are... The hollow? Well, no, that's one thing that showed up. One of them is the hollow. Which is a new biome. The real question is, where is it? So I guess this thing has a use after all. Because we have a lot of ground to cover. Hello, Tavern Keep. How are you doing? Can't stay. So I wonder where it is. 
Okay, this thing is actually really cool. <laughs> it doesn't take fall damage either. Or maybe it does, then just because I have wings. <gasps> Mid jump, though. That was good. Okay, here it is. This is the hollow. This is it. And just like always, everything around here is absolutely lethal and wants to murder you without a second thought. Even the sweet little pixies. What do you drop? Pixie dust. Unicorn! Unicorns are extremely lethal. Okay, bees are doing almost no damage to these. Thankfully, the demon scythe does. Alright, so what do I get from a unicorn? I kind of like the sound they make when you hit them. But I really want to find out what you get from a unicorn. Uh-oh, now there's two of them. That's not good. Fortunately, I'm pretty sure he can't get me up here. And I am terrible at aiming with this thing. It's the delay that makes it so hard to aim. Alright, two unicorns down, and I got a unicorn horn and a unicorn on a stick? What? What is a unicorn on a stick? A vanity item. Um, I have no idea. Oh, he can get up here. Oh, he can get up here. Okay. Definitely gonna need to have some kind of better weapon out here. Actually, I might already have one on me. Hold on. The Demon Sight does 50 damage, and that's great. I have a Diamond Staff here, however, that does 32. Oh, and I forgot that I also have this. So I can use that to help out as well. Yeah, deal with that. Yeah, see, that works. Rapid fire magical destruction. Alright, so on top of all of this, there should also be new ores in the world, I think think. And this being the hollow, this is actually where several NPCs want to live. I believe the party girl is one of them. So I'm gonna have to make a new house out here somewhere. Which is a good thing, because it'll mean that I'll have a safe place out here if I ever have to come and do, say, farming or something like that. I don't know about any special flora that will be out here. The fauna we've already met. So this is new. The other new thing is that the hollow and the crimson are going to start to spread. So I'm going to have to keep an eye on that. There are ways to keep them from spreading and there's dust that you can buy from the druid that can help you keep them both in check. Now, I don't know if I'm going to go through and completely purify the world of both the hollow and the Crimson. I haven't put a whole lot of thought into it. But it's something that I can do. It would just take a really long time. Alright, so let me go back to... here. And... is my guide back yet? I don't think so. I did kind of murder him to fight the Wall of Flesh. Let me 
double check and make sure he didn't pop up somewhere else. Guide? Hello, guide. No, I don't see the guide. That's okay, though. It just means that I need to wait for him to come around again. And I can actually do that by just sleeping the day away. So, give me a minute and I'll be right back with the guide. Okay, well, it's 10 o'clock the next day and the guide still hasn't shown up, which is unfortunate. So, instead, before I get off of here and take a break, I want to go see what we can get from the Crimson Biome. So now that we have a Pwn Hammer, not only is it, you know, just a great hammer, but it's the one hammer that can... Oh, wow. This got taken over fast. It's the one hammer that can break altars. Oh, wow, look at the entire desert. Everything's been taken over. I didn't realize it would go this fast. We may have to work on purification sooner than I expected. Well, this looks okay. I wonder why the desert became corrupted all of a sudden. Okay, so here we are. Now, one of the things that I will need is to find an altar. And I don't know if there's any altars left here. I might have broken all of them already when I was fighting the, uh, the Brain of Cthulhu. You're new. And painful. Okay, then. That just happened. Welcome to hard mode. All right, I guess maybe I should uh, completely suit up before I, I walk out of here. Uh, we'll, uh, we'll grab something to eat. We'll grab some potions. Don't really need a night owl potion. It's not night time. Okay, then. There's not enough villagers near the pylon. Why not? <gasps> Wait a minute. Oh, because the arms dealer's all the way over there? Why is he all the way over there? Okay, fine then. Um, we'll go to the jungle pylon? Well, at least this place looks normal. At least normal so far. What is that? Oh, those are big fish. And seeing as my imps are firing at it, I think I'm going to leave those big fish alone. Yeah, not my time. There's another one of those things that killed me. And it's coming after me. A herpling? What, what made that sound? Was it the fish? Fish don't make sounds, do they? Uh. That sounds awful. That is like the worst sounding thing ever. Or no, wait. Um, it's the crimson hearts I ran out of. Altars I know that I have around here. That's right. Okay, so no worries. I just need to find one altar and break it. Easier said than done around here. OK, 
Come on. If I throw enough bees at you, you have to die. Alright, at least those spider things die just as easily now. Hopefully I don't run any more of those herplings. They're tough. Okay, there's one altar, but I don't want to break that one if I can avoid it. There's got to be another possessed armor? Well, they're common, apparently. There's another one of those herplings. And another one over there. Yeah, I'm starting to wonder if this, uh, if this staff is not going to be suitable for any of this. Yeah, there's a gravestone from me. Lots of gravestones around here. Testament to how garbage I am at this game. Like I needed any more reminders. Ow. Oh yes, I definitely need a different weapon. What the... Toxic Sludge. Uh-huh. Yeah. More Toxic Sludge. I, I, I can... You, you can tell just how excited I am at the whole prospect of fighting Toxic Sludge. I do not see any more altars around here. Maybe I have to go somewhere else. I can jump here. And then... I should be able to jump over here again. And there's another Crimson Biome all the way close to the ocean. I'm running out of daylight, so I gotta make this trip fast. I don't know what that sound was, but that didn't sound nice. Come on. While I still have daylight on my side. Because goodness knows what's going to come out. When the sun goes down, that's a fish. <gasps> that's the thing that was making the noise. A derpling. Uh, you know what? I don't want to wait around and find out. I really don't. Heal me. Well, this stuff grew up fast. Alright, where's the underground? There it is. Okay. Altar. That looks like one right there. Oh good, that worked. Woo! No, 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 no. <laughs> That's unpleasant. All right, more bombs. I'll just bomb my way to it, break it, and we can go home. I hope. Plenty of water. Not worried about water. Alright, that did it! The world has been blessed with cobalt. Cool. Okay, is there anything here... ...that I can get rid of? What is that? A white? Wraith? Whatever it is, it's not good for me. 
I don't want to leave anything behind that might be important. What is this? Crimstone block. I don't have a whole lot of that. I don't think. But I have 54 now. Correction, 57. Alright, so I think that's everything that I'm getting out of this. I'm going home before I get killed. Whew. Wait. Tony? My arms dealer? What are you doing here? I don't know why you're here. But apparently this is where you decided to live? I'll have to figure out exactly what's going on with your house, because you should be back in the desert. But, um, that's probably why the guide hasn't shown up. So, I'm going to go ahead and take a break here. I'll find out why he's living here. Is that a thing in my house? Great. Now even my own castle isn't safe. Hard mode's going to be a fun adventure. Alright, so I am going to take that break now. When I come back, we will hopefully have the guy back here. We'll find out exactly what we can make with this stuff. We got pixie dust and unicorn horns. And somewhere deep underground, there's cobalt. And we're going to need it. So, we'll figure out exactly where and what we can do with it next time when we come back to more Terraria. Till then, take care.